And you mentioned that day that you get cast in something and then, you know, your parents get it, it, it's 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 international news that they have yeah. coronavirus because it was Rudy Gobert. It was all these sports leagues shutting down. What was that day like for you? Like, how did you find out about everything? It was pretty surreal. It was pretty surreal. Um, I had known uh, about their positive test for about 24 hours. Um, and there had been a good two to three days there where we knew that they weren't feeling well and we were trying to get them tested and okay, they are going to get tested and okay, they're waiting for the results. And all of this was happening while they were in Australia and I was in California. So there was, you know, an entire day of time change in between since they, they are uh, ostensibly we're living in the future. Um, But once we knew um, that was one thing, but then the announcement uh, rolled out, that was a little bit of a surprise for me. I didn't really know that was happening. Um, And all of a sudden my phone just started uh, uh, blowing up and, and there was this sort of, Uh, I don't want to say a panic, but there was definitely uh, a lot of people asking a lot of questions and me realizing that, you know, we needed to talk with my kids school and things like that, you know, just take basic precautions. I had to call my doctor's office and tell them like, yeah, I was in there earlier today, but I haven't seen them in three weeks. Um, I had to call up a casting director uh, who I had auditioned for earlier that day and say like, hey, just so you know, like. I haven't seen them in three weeks. They're in another country. So there was just a lot of like, I mean, I guess you could call it like contact tracing, but without the contact part, you know, it was a lot of that. Um, It was a pretty stressful 24 hours for sure. Um, Just because the amount that was unknown at that time was what was a lot. And so there was just a lot of, a a lot of panic. Um, But uh I, no point was I ever worried about their health or anything like that. I knew that they were in good hands and I knew that they had been, uh, you know, um, been, been in hospital by that point. So they were, they were well looked after. 